I want to talk a little bit now about the post. If you remember earlier, we notched those 6x6 posts so that the wood beam would sit on them, and we did that on purpose. Some people, I've seen it on decks and, and other things. There's two, two other ways to connect it. You could actually set the the frame or the beams on top of the post, which I think is really wobbly. Uh, you can also uh, basically layer the beam or bolt it to the side of the post. I don't like that either because then all the weight is just hanging on those uh, bolts. So the way I love to do it is I like to create a notch inside the post that the frame or that the beam sits on. Let's take a look at it right now. Look at this. So you can see, if you remember, we, we notched it out and we created a three and an eighth inch notch that is as high as the beam. And the reason why is when you sandwich these two treated two by twelves together, it ends up being three and an eighth inches. But you can see how this beam is solidly bearing down on the wood. And of course, when we use those carriage through bolts, it's just completely locked together. This beam is not going to topple off of the post. So it's an extremely strong connection. And I highly recommend if you're building a deck or if you are, you know, building a shed like this, that you make your connection this way. If you want to discover more home improvement tips, go to askthebuilder.com.